Hello everyone, welcome back to Fetch Quest. We're here today to advance further in our magical arts in Minecraft, all the mods 8. Now as you can see, I have spent some time adding crop areas. I've been adding crop areas, I've been adding a magical crop area over there and, and advanced the road over here. So we're going to check out all the advancements first and then we'll get right into magic. As you can see over here, the um, plants that are in these little bon botany pots are not really doing much. I, I'm not sure why, maybe someone can let us know, but for now we're just going to leave it like that. Over here we have some neverwort gr growing, um, so hopefully when we get some more soul sand we can even advance this little section over here. We've put turnips over here because we just never had a place on here because I took out the mystical agriculture stuff and I put it down here so as you can see there's now chickens in our place and a mystical creature I found I, I just put a little rope on him and he he came on along got a little bit more cows I did a little bit of breeding but we've taken out all the sheep now all the sheep oh, thank you Enderman all the sheep are actually down here I've added some colors already, but I don't have enough yet. Uh, some sheep died while moving. That's that's why, because I was using my double jump to fling them across, and some of them didn't have very sturdy legs, so that's that. But we will have all colored sheep here eventually. Also over here, you can see that because these crops are growing on this kind of yellowy dirt, it's actually giving me more seeds. So. Now I've made three areas and we only have two types of seeds so we will make more types of seeds and we will pretty much make a farm cascading all the way down and as you can see in that distance this road will eventually lead to our colony. Now as you can see this bridge it was tough to make I actually had to rebuild it a few times but uh, I finally got to it and uh, this bridge will make it much easier for me to travel to the town without having to cross the water. Our colonist, Seth, has already begun working on the tavern. It's very good. It took him a while. It always takes him a while to clear out these kind of things. So maybe next time, if anyone's doing a colony of their own, maybe don't put it on this kind of biome, because this can take up a lot of time. I had to help him out a few times. And then finally, there's one more adjustment that we have here we have spiced up this little area over here. Look, ooh, look, a nice totem of undying. And then I just spiced up my bedroom, just made it a little deeper as well. So I, I hope I, I can see the monsters if they're around, but I hope I can still successfully sleep in this area. And then of course, we've also spiced up this area over here. It's now a ladder going down to the mines. And it just looks much nicer. The kitchen as well has been spiced up. So now, no matter where we put things, like this, it will add and be connected so I can make whatever I want with a click of a button right here. It's much, much better. What should we make now? Ooh, pie crust. Rooty stew. Ooh. Oh, that one's pretty cool. Let's make that. So make, I've also made a lot of tea and steamed rice. Very delicious. Before we get back into the video, I just want to quickly say thank you everyone for your support of the channel. Checking the 3 Bean Channel Analytics, 60% of views are not subscribed. We would love to have you join the community that we are building. So please, take a moment to subscribe, like and share the video. We really appreciate it, thank you. Now back to the video. Now, for today's quest, we're going to make some clothes. Uh, some Ars Nouveau clothing. Probably the mage, the archmage one. So, what we're going to need is what I just collected, some of this crop, because I think the mage bloom can be turned into a string that's necessary for its creation. And on top of that, I think it's also iron armor, and we'll have to use the ritual, um, what, do you, what do you even call that, pedestal? That kind of area to make it. You can't just put it into a crafting table to make it. Ah oh, yes, here it is. Yeah, so we're going to need for the arcanist, I think. We're going to need uh, four for each, maybe, and then like the piece of armor in the middle. Let's just double check. Yeah, so that's eight. Yeah, so I think that's going to be the case. Did I check the other thing as well? Yeah, it's it's going to be 
four times four, which is sixteen. So we're gonna need sixteen fibers. Oh no, we've got plenty. Look at us, crazy. So let's put this in the storage system, and then that'll be fine. It is good to be back into the magic stuff. Now some of these actually have names, so I'm not sure if they'll work. We'll start with the ones that don't have names. Um, pedestals. Okay, yep. So one, two, three, four, and then bam. Okay, perfect. Seems to be working. Oh, I just love watching this. Mesmerizing. All right, cool. So we've got the hat. Where did the hat go? Went up here. Cool. Yep, okay, so that's that quest. Well, here's the quest over here, actually. I'll probably make the others at another time. I know, like, one of them requires gold. What is this one? Diamond, yeah, so... We're gonna start with the iron, then probably eventually get to the gold, and then go to the battle mage. But for now, this is what we're gonna do. So let's keep making... some more. Okay, it does work. Perfect, okay. And then we won't need these. Oh god, look at me, superhero. Yes, please. Thank you. One. Nope. 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 There we go. Back in it goes. One, two, three, and four. And then we'll put the boots in. Yep. And then we can just do this one over here. Perfect. Yep. And then, last one, put this here, in it goes. Look at that, magic's amazing. Easy. So now, whoa! I got the hat on. And all the rest is going on, look. Oh, look at me. Look at me now. <laughs> Hello there, Traveller. I'm going to take this off. Hello, Traveller. And look, you can see that I have <laughs> I have a little guy in my belt. He's tucked away. Don't touch. He's not, he's not for playing. He stays there. He's for my security. Very nice. This is perfect. This is so much better now. So now we're also... We should have, like, way more mana now, right? Yeah, it feels like I have more. <laughs> That's how I test, by the way. We're going to put away a lot of this armor stuff. You know, I, I'm even going to put away the shield and have the torch. Because I have noticed that it has been very difficult to see in caves. And I don't need to put them down. You know, I'm, I'm old school. I don't realize these things. Uh, I need to just have it in my hand and then it lights up the way. So, we're just going to do that from now on. Oh, jeez. And now that we've built that, we can claim all the rewards. So, what are we getting? random rewards. We got a horn and experience. What else we get? Some air essence. Ooh. What is this essence stuff? I, I don't know what this is or how to get it. Get some earth essence. Well, maybe we can finish off some of these things as well. So ooh, let's put this in the magical bounty chest. Perfect. All right then. So we do have the mushrooms now. Which is perfect. We can make the mushroom soup. I do have a root stew on, root stew on me, a rooty stew on me. But uh, we need to make the mushroom soup so we can finish off these things up here. So we still need to make the alchemical so source link, the mycelial source link, and a potion jar to kind of finish off these this kind of section. And then maybe we can try and get a tier two glyph. Alright, here they are. Okay, so let's make this stew. We need the red and the brown. There's the stew. So, nope, that's the wrong one. My cereal will also need two gold and then two of those. One, two, and one, two. Now we have the mycelial source link. We can move on and I can get rid of that to the next one. What is that? That's the jar, isn't it? What do we get? Fire essence, nice. Okay, so with the jar, what does that require? And what can that do? The potion jar stores up to 100 potions, and you can remove them by 
An empty bottle. Oh, okay, so that's neat. So if we do... We have a blaze rod. We don't... We haven't even made a brewing area. Maybe we'll do some of that. But anyways, it's a sauce jar with abjuration essence. Oh my god. Abjur essence is made with fermented... Sp oh my lord. Milk, sugar, and fermented... Sp oh god, okay. I've not made fermented... Um, spider eye in ages. Let's have a look. I'm pretty sure we do have these things though. So it's just a matter of finding them. Uh, spider eye. So, was that up here? It might be. Ah, yes, here. And it was sugar. We can just make one. Alright, so we got sugar as well. So let's make that spider eye. I don't know, unless you do potions, it's not nothing that, you know, important, so. Milk. We need some milk. I do have a bucket over here. And then we can just scoop it up from our cow in a jar. I still can't get over how ridiculous that sounds. But, uh, that's what it is right here. Moo. Thank you. Oh, God. Um, what else was it? It was this and... Oh no, I need another sugar anyways. Oh, that's fine. Wait, do I have a sugar in here? Any one of these? Yes, I do. Okay, we'll just do that. Perfect. Uh, nope, wrong altar. Let's go up here. I've got so much sauce too. So, how does this work? Nope, I need this essence. Spider on top. I guess it doesn't matter rotation-wise, does it? Milk, sugar. Milk, sugar, I, I at the top, like this, and then milk, and then sugar, and then what goes in the middle? One of these. Oh, God. I didn't grab any, did I? One moment. Look at me race down these. Okay, quickly. And Dora the Mighty. I don't think she's the explorer. He's over here. Getting in the way. Jesus. Oh, we better put that essence away. Easy. So we've got all kinds of essence. Alright. Put this away. Put that instead. We've got some rice. Source gem. And then it should be ready. It's been a while since I made a blaze thing as well. Let's go. Wait, what? Did I read this wrong again? What goes in the middle? Fermented? But it needs sauce. Oh, does it need this? Hang on. There's sauce. I have saucy sauce. What if I put it here? Pedal sauce must be... The recipe is right here. What am I doing wrong? Do we have to... Pour the sauce in? Um, this is so strange to me. Is that... What does it mean? What does it mean? I don't get it. What am I doing wrong, guys? What, are, what am I doing wrong? Honest, honestly, I'm so lost. Because I know that these jars power machines, but it doesn't say anything. It just says, to start collecting some sauce, we'll need... So uh, that, that's for the sauce jar, right? But then when you go to the potion thing, it says the potion jar stores... It, that's what it does, that's its function. It doesn't say anything. Ab abjuration essence is... Isn't that the... No, that's an enchanting... Imbument... In this? Wait... Do we need to get more pedestals? For this? Maybe that's it. Hang on. We might have to renovate. Like that. To 
goes up there, and then the rest is. Alright, so now we've got eight pedestals. Gosh, going through our goal. And hopefully we can fix this. I didn't realize that the other one needed, like, the pedestals as well. I just thought that's what it was. Oh well. Where do we want to move it to? Um. Well, I mean, we can take this and then take this. That's that. Take these out. And then, um. Put it in this corner, I suppose. Like in the middle. Do I need a core too? What, what did they say the core's for? Well, I think. Where's the core? But the core, what is this? The core is used for. Chat is used to trust. It also uses multiple blocks. Also, that you do is that start by placing an icon core in the ground and then place it. Do we need the core? We'll find out. Okay, so we're gonna do this. Oh, it's gonna look a bit funny. Like this, right? And then, what was it? One, two, move that. Move that. Oh, we should put the jar behind it like the other one. Yeah. And then the milk and then the gem, right? So it was saying something like that, 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 and then the gem in the middle. Oh, so this is how uh, the source is coming from here. This, oh, there it goes. Is it making more than one? No, that's it. Okay. And we can make a few out of it. Interesting. Wow. I guess. Is it using anymore? Is it? Oh, it needs the source gem. So it can make two? Hmm. Huh. Very interesting. Okay, well that's fine. Just have this really weird angle. Maybe I'll move things around eventually, but Jesus. Okay, so that's done. Thank <laughs> you.